So previously, as you guys know, like we discussed and reviewed Halo AI, which according to me was one of the best AI video generator that you can go ahead and use right now. And the best part about that is you can go ahead and use that for absolutely free with Halo AI's three day free trial. So today in this video, we're going to go ahead and dive deep into the Halo AI's prompting techniques. We're going to discuss every possibility that you can go ahead and get while generating videos with image to video generation so for instance let's just say i take this image of a person right so i can go ahead and make this image like into different emotions like i can make this person smiling crying laughing change the camera motion or even make him do different action as well so yeah without further ado let's discuss different techniques of creating image to videos in halo ai all right guys so here i am again in the home page of halo ai so yeah as this tool was really really good like for me it was the best in class so we absolutely have to dive again into the ai video generation of halo ai and trust me guys in this tutorial you'll be able to see like lots of amazing and creative examples that you'll be confused like how far we have gone in video generation with ai so yeah, before starting, we're going to go ahead and break down this tutorial into different levels. So first of all, in level one, we're going to go ahead and do image to video generation with no prompt. So that will be a very simple animation. And in level two, we're going to be dealing uh, with little animations in our videos, like maybe a man smiling or waving his hand. Then in level three, you guys, it's going to get a bit interesting. Like we're going to go ahead and take a single image and be dealing with different type of emotions and reactions that you can get with Halo AI. So that would be really, really exciting. And in our last level, level four, we're going to go ahead and play around with some complex tags like camera motion or, you know, just having another subject or another human within that video. So yeah, like that would be really interesting to see how Halo AI is going to perform in that. So yeah, without further ado, let's start this amazing tutorial, you guys. All right, guys. So these all will be the images that we're going to go ahead and create videos of. So first of all, we're going to jump to our level one in which we're going to go ahead and just simply take a simple image. So let's just say I go ahead and take uh, this image of a woman. So she's a Hispanic woman. So this is a really beautiful, uh, like a portrait a landscape image. So I'm going to go ahead and take that simply drop this in halo ai so the process is really simple uh, we already have discussed this before and in that you need to make sure you turn this option on and then after that you just have to simply provide the prompt but as this is our level one so we're not going to go ahead and input any prompt we're just going to go ahead and create this and let's just see the output all right so there you go guys this was the simple video it came out with yeah you guys can see it looks really really good look absolutely perfect so we didn't put any prompt into that it was a uh, still image as i told you guys which was that and it basically just input a little bit of animation you guys can see the background the birds are moving and the uh, lady is sitting or standing still uh, she is just moving her eyes like a real video would look like so yeah that is a really cool animation you guys can see yeah i know it is like a very a still very subtle but yeah you guys can see it looks really really realistic which is precisely our point right there okay or another thing you can go ahead and do in that or you can provide a very little prompt you can simply type animate this scene and it's going to basically go ahead and take this image right over here and provide a bit of a zoom in effect like you know ai will do all the magic for you you just have to trust uh ai in that so i just simply provided a prompt like animate this scene so it basically provided a very cool uh you know zoom in effect into that so this is our next example uh, we have the same prom and he made this scene and yeah you guys can see the effect looks really really good uh we have a slide zoom in cinematic effect over here and yeah this looks like like it is a scene from a movie and similarly the third one and he made this scene our prom once again and yeah very good animation to our video right like halo ai generates absolutely amazing realistic results to the images and it provides life to your images like you haven't seen before okay all right, so moving on to our second level, we'll be providing a little bit of actions uh, to the scenes in our video. So first of all, let's just take this example, right? So this is a video of a couple posing for camera. So I basically input this image right over here in which both of the persons were already smiling. So I just simply typed in my prompt like couple posing for camera. So what's really important about Halo AI is like you don't have to play around with too much prompting, right? You just have to be as precise as simple and as short as you can so yeah this was my still image right and the both of them are already smiling so i just type in my prompt like couple posing for camera and it basically provided me absolutely fantastic animations right over there right 
you know, uh, the way uh, like the girl is looking at the guy and the guy is looking back, like, you know, this motion, it is so much real, like I'm really much confused, like how realistic this is. And you guys can see in the frames, we have very consistent character, right? Like it's not like some features are missing or we have some deformation. Everything looks top notch and very, very realistic over here, you guys, right? Similarly, for the next example, I basically input this image. So this image uh, was just a girl, uh, uh, maybe she's modeling or she's walking down the aisle and then basically provided the same information in my prom, like which is girl walking down the aisle. And it basically provided me these results. Like, take a look at this. So, wow, this looks really, really good, right? You know, the way camera is uh, zooming out and the girl is walking and it completes the frame absolutely perfectly. And yeah, this looks really, really good. So yeah, in level two, you can provide a little bit of information in your prompt. And yeah, Halo AI is going to do the best in that, right? Similarly, I did the same over here as well. So by looking at this image, what you can say is the guy doing, right? So the guy is maybe presenting or giving a speech. So that's exactly, I input it in my prompt like a man giving speech and Halo AI did this animation for me, right? Yeah, this looks really, really good, right? The way he's moving his hands, like obviously, yeah, we see a bit of a deformation like this video is really, really fast forwarded. But you guys can take an idea like Halo AI did an absolutely fantastic job right over here, right? So our last example in this uh, level is I took this image and yeah, I basically provided a bit of an action uh, into that. So let's just say I want this person to wave at the camera, right? So simply, I'm going to be as simple as I want. So I'm going to write man smiling, waving at someone, right? So take a look at this, how Halo AI is going to do that job for me. Oh my God. Wow. This is way too good, right, you guys? So yeah, the way this guy is... Uh, moving and he's smiling immediately and is waving at the same time. Like we don't see any deformation in his hands. Uh, we don't see any distortion. There's nothing, nothing wrong with this video right over here, right? Like it looks too good to be real, you guys, right? So this is how you can go ahead and play around with like subtle motions, like subtle actions that you can make uh, people in your videos to do. So yeah, that was a really good demo. All right, so now moving on to our next level, which I'm most excited about. So now we're going to go ahead and play around with emotions. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take a one simple image. So let's just say I take this image of an old man who's just looking uh, down the window, right? So this image was created with mid journey. So now I'm going to be showing you how many different kind of emotions I can create with Halo AI. I can have this man smiling, laughing, worried, crying. I could do anything I want and you know, the consistency, like the character would remain absolutely same in all of her frames, you guys, right? So first of all, I basically took this image, went to Halo AI and simply type in my most simple prom like man smiling. So this is what Halo AI did for me, you guys. Okay, yeah, this looks really, really good. Not too bad. The man is smiling very good. And you know, the way his eyes is, you know, squinting and, you know, like the beard movements. Previously, we used to see like whenever you used to do these kind of emotions, uh, the face just, you know, gets blown away, but not anymore. Halo AI did really, really wonderful job, especially in humans. That's exactly why I'm very much excited to, you know, work this on human faces. All right, so now moving on to the next one. So I have my same image right over here. And this time, I'm going to go ahead and make this man surprised. Okay, let's just see how that's going to turn out now. All right, wow, this is really, really good, right? Like, you know, the face remains the same. Uh, his eyes just, you know, opened wide. And this guy is surprised and a bit of a confused, but yeah, it's a really interesting emotions. Now you can go ahead and do with the help of Halo AI, right? It's like really, really good with the emotions, you guys. Okay, now for the third example, I'm going to go ahead and make this guy worried. Okay, let's just try that out. Okay, yeah, you guys can see we have a little bit of squinting in his eyebrows. Uh, he looks worried. He's like, you know, tense about something you guys can literally see like he's talking and he is not happy, he's worried about something, right? Yeah, so this was a really good uh, emotion as well. Then the next one, uh, I'm going to go ahead and make him thinking about something, right? So I'm just going to type man thinking, that's all. So let's just see this video now. Okay, yeah, that was a bit of an interesting uh, expression right over there. Uh, he is certainly looks like, like not too accurate, uh, I must say, but yeah, it looks like he is thinking about something right over there, right? All right, so another very cool example in this level, I'm going to show you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and take a photo of this human right over here. And yeah, I'm telling you guys right now, you would be blown by how many types of things I'm going to perform with this single static image, right? 
So first of all, I input this image and this is a video of the same man crying and wiping his tears with the tissue. Like, take a look at this video you guys write over here. Okay, so this is the first one. Wow, this looks really, really good. Okay, then we have the second one. So this man is laughing all of a sudden and drinking juice. Okay, very interesting. Now the next one, uh, we have this man, uh, you know, with just having some like subtle expression, not doing anything important. Then the fourth one, like man laughing and taking off his jacket. Okay, yeah, that was a really good one to like take a look at how beautifully he is keeping all those characters in every frame like then the last one and my favorite like man wears sunglasses with angry face like take a look at this how beautifully and how accurately it wore the sunglasses and you know he's making angry face and he's probably swearing about something he's not happy at all so yeah it was really really amazing like you know with just this static image i went ahead and had this mind do different things with the help of a single static image right so yeah this is how you can go ahead and play around with emotions with the help of halo ai you guys right all right so for the last level what you can go ahead and do is you can have any other object within uh, your image right so let's just say i have this image i want uh, to you know just move around my camera and have focus on some any other object so this time i provided camera panning and tilting to a dog right take a look at this video you guys right over here so this man is playing guitar and all of a sudden the camera moves away and we now can see a dog in this video as well, right? So yeah, that was a really amazing, a really a fluid flow of camera right over there. The video looks really, really good. Then you can go ahead and do like some camera motions as well. Like I performed zoom out effect on the boy uh, with guitar. But unfortunately, according to my testing, like Halo AI doesn't perform that good with human faces. But similarly, if I go ahead and do around with some any other uh, you know, like static objects. So let's just say this was a simple image of some studio setup. And I simply type in zoom in and it basically provided me very amazing zoom in effect in that studio, right? Uh, this camera woman looks really, really good, right? Similarly, I basically went ahead and tried out with this image as well. So this time I had my camera zoom into some man's face. And all of a sudden, you guys can see we have uh, some man, you know, just crossed by uh, this person and, you know, the camera focuses on that person all of a sudden. So, yeah, this is how you can go ahead and include some other objects, uh, you know, some other humans maybe as well in your videos too. And similarly, for the last example, I have like two of my things combined in one video. So, I have like camera motion as well. So, camera would be panning and tilting to a woman. So, I will include woman in the video as well. Like, take a look at this video right over here. So, we have a static video right over here and suddenly the camera moves all of a sudden and now uh, we have some focus on a woman right yeah uh, the video looks really really good we have a very fluid motion it looks like you know it's recording from uh, a normal camera you guys can see we have that a uh, jerky effect that we see uh, when we record with real camera so yeah this video was really really amazing as well so yeah, there you have it guys. This was a deep dive in how you can go ahead and get possible uh, video outputs with the help of Halo AI. So yeah, the possibilities are basically endless. You can try anything you want. And you know what's cool about this is like if you're going to go ahead and sign up right now with your fresh account. So you'll get a three day free trial with that. You'll be able to generate as many videos as you want. But uh, there's a one bummer like the wait time is really, really high right now. Probably you have to wait around like uh, 10 to 15 minutes for a single video to generate if we have a long queue so yeah uh, make sure that you have that in your mind as well so yeah that's it for today you guys i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next one till then take care bye bye